Hey guys, make sure to send your DNT if you make one common mistake you may end up spending thousands of dollars on tools, parts and diagnostic that you may actually not even need. Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be a super helpful video to any of you having a BMW X3 X4 that generation here from year 2010 to year 2018. If you have one of those and if you need to find guys where the fuses and the relays for the rear view camera are located, where you can find them, where you can guys also buy parts, tools, fuses, relays at a good price, quick shipping. That way you do not waste money and time. Why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays, all that will be covered absolutely free for your convenience please make sure to stay until the end so before we start guys let us tell you a little bit about us every single car we get here at the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos we take them completely apart we show you how to fix engines transmissions engine codes fuses uh, bodywork a little bit of everything why we guys do that because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can all we need in return please subscribe to the channel like the video that way we can keep making these absolutely free videos for you and guys if you need to buy any parts to use at a good price quick shipping that way do not waste money and time we're going to put links in the description of the video below for your convenience check it out that way do not waste your money guys also we will have more than 14,000 free repair videos on our youtube channels check them out guys we'll have videos that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs as well so let's start on it now so guys this bmw has many hidden fuse boxes that most people do not know that they even exist you have up to five or six different fuse boxes and for many of you okay some of those are special fuse boxes kind of like this one here if you don't know about them guys we'll recommend to check out the video on our youtube channel about fuse box location on bmw x3 x4 check it out it can save you thousands of dollars in repairs the fuses and the relays for the rear view camera on BMW X3 X4 where you can find them we will demonstrate on this BMW here guys now X3 X4 they're built on the same platform so it should work for both practically it's the same vehicle with a little bit uh, different uh, design of the roof we'll be working two different fuse boxes the first one that we need is on the passenger side go ahead open the door open the glove box empty the content and here guys on, uh, on the right side the very back you have one cover press that tab pull that cover out and you're going to find a fuse box with a layout like this one before we guys continue let's explain quickly why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays so let us tell you guys why it's super important to test fuses and relays fuses guys sometimes are really hard to know if they're burnt or not for instance i'm going to pull one fuse here okay and sometimes you cannot clearly see if they're good they're bad and let's say you think you have a good fuse you put it back in and you end up having problems again and you spend time money you buy parts diagnostics you pay for services that you don't need guys you practically wasted your money so all you have to do waste uh, ch ch check your fuses that way you don't waste money guys so always test your fuses even if you think it's good always test it it even happened to us guys okay and we work on cars all the time another thing always test your relays they're a little bit harder to uh, test but if you want to see guys how to test fuse relays we will put a link in the description of the video below but we've seen so many customers that think that they have a good fuse they put it back in they waste their money on parts and diagnostic that they practically guys do not need so check out the link in the description of the video below how to test the fuse and how to test the relay as well so guys now we need to check two fuses we'll talk about the relays in a little bit you wonder where they're located now so if you come right here guys okay let's zoom in a little bit perfect just like that so you can clearly see the first one that you need to check that's fuse seven eight fuse number eight right here that fuse will need to be checked very important fuse after that you need to check fuse number 45 so that's 43 44 45 some of you may or may not have this one depending on which model and package you have then you need to open the trunk and in the trunk guys on the right side here pull that cover lift the insulation up behind it you have a fuse box that looks like this one here specifically guys we need to check one fuse and that fuse is known as fuse number uh, 130 so uh, this fuse guys of okay if you come right here 
some of you will have that one will be in that row of uses here that's 127 28 29 30 it will be right here so you may ha have only one fuse you may have up to three fuses relays you don't have any relays guys practically the relay function is controlled by the body control module so those are known as relay fuses so if you have problems with the cameras not working partonics anything like that check these fuses first so guys if you need to buy uh, parts, tools, fuses, relays for your BMW at a good price, quick shipping guys. We're going to put a link in the description of the video below where you can get them from because we have very specific fuses, especially these little fuse boxes guys, those could be really hard to find. You can see like the one right here as well guys and we'll put a link in the description of the video below where you can get them at a good price, quick shipping as well. Hopefully guys the video will be helpful. If you have any questions let us know. Thank you for watching and see you guys next time.